When love grabs hold of a couple, they're often not focused on practical decisions like finances, but instead on the pleasures of the heart. But if you're searching for wedded bliss, money can be a deal breaker. So here to tell us more is Howard Dvorkin of Consolidated Credit Counseling Services. Okay, Howard, you have to play matchmaker, marriage counselor, financial planner, all in one. You ready? It's a tough job. I think I'm pretty good at the money part. Marriage, I'm a little rough on. All right, so let's talk about marriage and money and what does one person need to ask the other person? I mean, people have to know what they're getting into. And it, part of that is not only knowing the person emotionally, but part of it is knowing what the person's finances are and certainly the financial past, the financial history of that person because all of a sudden you don't want to get married and the next day you find out, surprise, you're in debt or you have be- the, your spouse has bad credit, you have to be concerned with all this. And money is one of, if not the biggest problem when it comes to marriage and divorce, right? Certainly it is. And because it, marriage is tough enough. But when you add financial pressure into the mix, it really comes apart. Plenty of people call our offices every single day because their marriage is suffering, because of the financial stress. And what people have to do is go through and ask questions. Go through and ask, do you have credit outstanding? What's your past credit look like? Do you have savings? How, do you, how were you raised even? Did you talk about uh, finances at the kitchen table? To prenup or not to prenup? That is the question. Well, if they're marrying <laughs> you, prenup. <laughs> Definitely prenup. But... For most of the people, they don't need a prenup. I mean, if you were getting married when you're young, uh, you probably don't need it. But at the same time, if you have accumulated, if one spouse has accumulated assets, you certainly need to take that into consideration and consult a lawyer. All right. Good to see you, Howard. And remember, ask that money question, an important question to ask. And if you want more money advice or tips from Consolidated Credit Counseling Services, head over to southflorida.com slash money.